All right, it's time for the last reprint set, Invasion of Chaos. In this one, we got a few cool ones, like Chaos Emperor Dragon, Envoy of the... Chaos, no, just Chaos Emperor Dragon, not Envoy. Um, being the main secret to hope for. I uh, forget what the other one is. I think it's Invader of Darkness, which isn't really a good one. Um, and then the main ultra being like Buster Blader Envoy and a Demock himself, Dark Magician of Chaos. Yeah. So those are the big ones. Um, I think there's one other one that's kind of... Oh yeah, the, um, the one spell card is good for format. And I can't open this box. Um, maybe it's telling me no. Yeah, other than that, um, there's the main things we're hoping for. Definitely, uh, probably not one of my favorites. I think I like it a little bit more than Spell Ruler. But I think I like Blue Eyes Toon more than any card in here. But I think Blue Eyes Toon's like the only thing I really, really like in Magic Ruler. Sasuke, Chaos End. Yeah, as I got to this era of cards, you can tell they start to get uh, pretty overpowered with how Chaos Emperor and uh, Envoy work. And that's why they. And like Yada Garasu. Although that's a different set for that card. Robin Zombie. Big burn. Look at it burning. I think this, that's a super rare. I always see pulled when I see people open this set. Yeah, I hope you guys have been enjoying the reprint sets. It's cool seeing them again, but it's not really worth opening up maybe more than one box because just like, yeah. It's just cheaper to get the cards if you like a lot of them. <laughs> but that's how it's always been, so. But it just being, you know, like everyone knows what it's for. Just to open old packs like Nostalgia. Make them even more affordable since, you know, Booster Box is like 70 something. And, you know, I get 24 packs. So, good uh, rate. But then after this, yeah, I probably won't be open any more of this. Of, uh, <clears throat> the old reprints. Unless they just kind of come across in, like, maybe smaller versions. Um, kind of like how they did earlier in the year with the, uh, <clears throat> that little box. But other than that, uh, yeah, I don't see myself opening more booster boxes of this. It's cool, but unless I really get that itch to open old stuff again, I don't think I really want to. Just... I don't know. Oops, I skipped. Oh, nice. It's the biggest card in there. Dimension Fusion. That's... Nice. It's surprising, because uh, when I look at it, I want to think this is the biggest card in the set, but it's um used a lot in GOAT format, because it's like really overpowered or something. Because special summoning banished monsters with a lot of banishing mechanics instead of... Yeah. <clears throat> Nice. Well, this might be the best box, depending how else we can get in here. I've never seen this guy before in my life. Getsu Fum. Oh, okay. Interesting. That's not really a good effect, but it looks pretty cool. <coughs> yeah. As a kid, I don't think I opened up any of this set. I opened up a lot more of uh, the even older sets. and But I, I did open up some GX sets, but not too much. It was mainly the, uh, oops, I skipped this. DD Scout Plane, what the heck is this? It's an orb. <laughs> it's an orb. <clears throat> All right. Forgot that a lot of banishing stuff in this set. Fiends and Mirror. And they got, got into a lot of, started using a lot of effects this time around. And look, a 1900 beat stick. Like, that's crazy. They wouldn't even think about that in LLB. <laughs> you gotta sacrifice one monster to get 1,500 and attack for some of their monsters. It's crazy. Soul absorption. Smashing ground. Moon zombie. But they had to, you know, do the 
It's a low power creep. creep. Get everything slowly stronger to the point now where it's all um, just crazy negates in modern. Look at that balloon. But this is like when I started making almost everything out of effects. Just to... Just to make it more interesting. So at least more sets where they can just kind of keep releasing vanilla 500 attack monsters <laughs> that are like two stars. But you know. Little Berserk, I know he was used a lot in old ones. Phibius, kind of mind you. <clears throat> Alright, looks like we'll have the secret on this side. Hopefully it's uh, Chaos Emperor, but <clears throat> my look with su secrets hasn't been that good. Even though it's a 50-50 you know, chance, uh, that chance doesn't, uh, always, oh, there we go, never mind. So this time it did go out, work out for me, eh? Not too bad. The last two uh, with uh, Spell Ruler and uh, Her Servant didn't uh, want to give me those uh, nice secrets. They wanted to give me the uh, the other ones. And then LLB, I think both secrets aren't really too crazy, but I like Gaia a little bit more than Trihorn, so. But what, what can you do? So. Reload. Alright, we got one more super and one more ultra to go in here. Hopefully we can get a another like crazy ultra that would be like a goat box if we got um either Demok or uh, Black Soldier. Envoy of the beginning. But yeah, if you guys have things that you'd all and all see be opened if you want if you do want more, twenty fifth old anniversary. Like booster boxes, I'll think about it, or just like those little um, special, not special editions, whatever. but they have, you know, one of each of the old packs in a little box. Or, because I do plan to do um, some of the sets I missed out on that were new. I do those. Obviously, Pokemon stuff, uh, you'll see. That's probably what I'm primarily going to be doing. I should have 151 videos. Oh, because I'm not going to put all of the old ones out in a row. This will be, you know, the last in the line since it's the last set. Originally, I was just going to kind of choose them randomly, but I decided to kind of just do them in order, I guess. Because, oh, uh, it's Le... Wait, Le... Wait, what? What is this? Levi Dragon Daedalus. I think I had this card as a kid. I didn't know it was an Ultra Rare, though. That's interesting. So, yeah, I remember having this card as a kid. Huh. I always thought it was kind of cool too, but I don't think it was <laughs> that good. So, well, unfortunately, we're going to get all bangers in the big ones. That's probably not that great of an ultra. Very forgettable, but the secret in one ultra. Went pretty hard, so. And they technically combo into each other, I think, with uh, their effects. Alright, well, it's probably not too worth it to open these because it's probably only one super. I was hoping maybe at one of the boxes. I know it's very, very, very rare. Oh, Wild Nature's really second. I can't even tell that was a super. A berserk gorilla going gorillas. Let me get one more ultra. A three ultra box or a two super box or secret box. It's for the duster. All right, three more packs. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed all this legacy stuff. Definitely always nostalgic. You know, it's cool as getting it in you know first dead and getting that old card smell and that good crisp pack. Dude. These ones open pretty nice though, at least. But like, you know, having the old style card stock and that first edition text on there. <coughs> but yeah, hope you guys, at the end of this last one, enjoyed. I don't know, 
I'm not sure what my favorite out of all these was. Probably still Metal Raiders because Block Skull Dragon. But let me know what your favorite is down. Dang. Ooh, what is that? Gore totally. I've never seen that before. But yeah, not too bad with the dimension and the chaos. Let me know what your guys' favorite out of the, the five sets is, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.